Welcome back to Bean Crazy Custom Creations. I'm Miss Francis. This is Miss Jeannie. Um, we're going to do some dragons. Oops, Jeannie's, Jeannie's alarm's going off. We're going to do some dragons. Um, I've already colored them. And I colored them with Kaleidos Shift um, mica powders from, or Kaleidos Shift powders from Solar Color Dust. And I have three different ones already colored. I have this one, which I'm going to pour in black. And that light. Let's turn it this way a little bit. Maybe you can see better. There's the skull with the big horns and two dragon heads. That one's colored. And then... Here's the little dragon with the welcome sign. And then I have the mama dragon with the baby dragon. So those are the three that we're going to do. And they, I've got them so they're all sitting in my tray here. So I'm hoping that I can pour them that way. And they all can be in there, but I probably won't come back down and do any more with the video until morning. So, and then I also had the little dragon head, which all I did was color certain parts of it gold. So we can sit over there for the moment. I'm going to start out, because I have no clue. I'm going to start out by mixing up eight ounces of black. <clears throat> so that I can uh, get them poured, but I'm pretty sure it's probably going to take more than eight ounces. But we're going to start there, so we'll be back as soon as we got it mixed up. All right, I mixed up eight ounces, which is probably not enough, but we're going to roll with it for the moment. And see if it'll fill it in. See how many I can get filled in with the eight ounces. Maybe not very many. I don't know. We've been down here for a while. I've been coloring my molds before because I don't, most people know how to dust a mold. I don't really need to show them how to do it, but I'm trying to make some short videos and get them, so I can get them up. And why am I not getting that in his ear? It's not going in that ear all the way. Or wing, tip of its wing. I don't really want to <clears throat> pour a whole bunch in there. Hang on, listen. Jeannie did it. She hmm. coughed. <laughs> she coughed and she made it blow. All right. I'm going to try and get them squeezed in as much as I can. I can do this one. to mix up some more for sure just to finish these off bottom of them's filled up oh no don't do it don't do it don't do it you're gonna do it I need something to scrape with here. I don't know that it's going to work. Nope, sorry, it's spilling out. Darn it. 
We can work. <sighs> yeah, I did it. I sure did. I sure overfilled it. Yeah, because it's going up underneath. Yeah, it's going underneath it all over the tray. I don't know how I did that. Well, I was waiting for the top to fill, and I wasn't paying attention to what the rest of it was doing. And I can't move it now. All I can do is pour some out of it. Try and scoop some. It's already pouring down here at the bottom of the tray. I grabbed a spoon. Because that's about the only way I'm going to get enough of it out. It's already over all over my tray here. I don't think I can get it out of there. Darn it. Darn it. <laughs> Can't blame me. No, I did that one all, all by myself. I did it <laughs> all by myself. I made a mess. I have made a mess. But I don't want to take too much out of it because the ears, if I do, yeah, I don't know. I'll worry about cleaning it up later. Because I don't know that I can wipe it up. Get that over there away. Okay. I don't think I have enough still in there. Can you let that spoon off, please? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Now, how did I have this thing? I don't think it was like that. Don't you dare. Don't you dare do that. I already got enough over here to clean up. Gonna mess over there going. I don't think there's enough to finish this one. Nope, I'm gonna have to mix some more up. Okay, well, we will mix some more up and be back. I don't know whether I want to mix a whole eight ounces up, but. She does have some other stuff over there to be poured. So, that she wants. So, we may mix up another eight. I don't think it's going to take eight. I ain't worried about getting my arm in it. That's my epoxy. Oh. That's my epoxy jacket. <laughs> it's already got epoxy all over it. That's why I put it on. Because if I get epoxy on it, no big deal. No big deal. No problemo. Nope. Same with the one you're wearing. <laughs> it don't matter. <laughs> it's already got epoxy on it. All right. Well, we're going to clean the cup up. Mix up some more, and we'll be back. All right, we're back. I made up another eight ounces of black mica with, or black epoxy with uh, Let's Resin Black Mica. I'm going to finish this one. And get it poured. And then I'm going to put them in the machine. And let them cure. Sure is tongue that's sticking out is full. 
I'm assuming this is part of the I colored it as if it was part of the skull because that's what it looked like it was to me so Be careful here. Slow your roll. Looks like it's flexible enough. All right, so I'm going to put, I'm going to before you pour any of it out of there and let me let me check his tongues and some of his horns to make sure they're full all the way. I hate to hate to spray it with some alcohol because I don't I don't want it overflowing. I do want it in there where it's supposed to be. Everything else looks good. Alright. Here's your... Oh, you got a paper towel. Alright, I'm going to spritz these real lightly. Because I don't want them overflowing. That one's the one that looks like it's got a bunch of bubbles coming up. The other ones don't. Okay. So these are going to go in the curing machine. And we'll see you back in... Well, she's going to pour some. Miss Jean's going to pour some. She's going to pour this dragon head. Let me turn it going to pour the dragon head and we still got part of an alien to be finished while I put this in the curing machine and get it started. Ooh, come on, come on, don't you do it, don't you do it, don't you do it, don't you do it. Don't you dare do it. close to, but you didn't. Okay. Let me get this stuff out of the way. Hopefully I got everything back far enough. I can get my lid on. Make sure I got the lid on there all the way. What time is it? Second. 10.43. Well, we won't be back down tonight anyway. We're not coming back down tonight to get them out. Get them out in the morning. Was there a hole in the center of that one? The dragon. No. You sure? I don't think so. Yeah, where'd my little tool go that I just had? Yeah, it's gone. But this is running. I think she's trying to make sure it did. Well, I know. It's it's not that. I think this that board is not level. So, hold on a second. Let's this one's a little more level than that one is. Let's slide it over here. See if we can level it out some. Hopefully. If not, we'll just take that little spoon and we'll just scoop it out. Scoop it off of there. Scoop it off again. Yeah, well. I mean, Better to scoop it off than to let it overflow. Yes. I think that's better now. I think it's better than it was. 
as long as I don't spritz it. But it'll probably have a bunch of. And we got this alien to finish. but that doesn't mean it's going to. Trying not to mess his hand up. This peace sign up here. Yeah, we gotta make sure that he's a keychain. Yep, make sure it's filled. Okay, that's filled. What are you doing here? I'm just putting molds up there. What are we doing? Two bears? No, I just set them up here just to be on the safe side. Because there's a bear and a dog. Yeah, I don't want to pull them just. Okay. Hold on. Hold on, no, no, no. Leave him there. I'm just not going to pour him in just plain black. Oh. I'm going to add something to that plain black. Oh. Like some pretty gold. 14 karat gold there. Oh, nugget by eye candy. Make it so it ain't just plain black. I'm gonna have to add that to my list. Yeah. Okay. Stir it up again. Making. Make them look a little, have a little bit of sparkle anyway, and not just plain black. What you think I wanted you to do? Put them back? Yes. No. <laughs> I just wanted to give it a little bit of color. Can't get all that scraped off my stick there. <laughs> I'm trying. Alright, so we just added some 14, 14 karat gold. nugget gold from eye candy in there to give it a little bit of color, a little bit of sparkle. Did Boy, I'm, no, but I'm bound to determine I'm going to make a mess tonight, a big <laughs> mess. Bound to turn. Okay. Got him. Got his ears. Done. That one is not 
exactly. It's got something in it. Besides hair. It had a little piece of something in it. Let's see. It might come close, but it's not gonna. Yeah, it might come close to filling it all away, but that's okay. We can always fill it with another color. scrape it and get it all to come out one way here. Not quite. It's close. Close, but no cigar. Yeah, I was trying to get all that, a lot of that gold out of there. Cause I got it stuck all over the stick. But I thought I might get it out. For the most part, get it scraped out of the cup. You're going to need alcohol for sure on that one. <laughs> Otherwise, you're probably not going to get that gold out of there. And this one's going to need more than what's in there. Okay. I'm going to squidge in a little bit. Not that, not that he needs it, but you never know. Why do I have it running down the back? I don't know. But better set him over there because he's not going to be finished. Alright. We will be back in the morning to unmold these lovely things before I make another big mess. Which... I got messes everywhere going here. All right. We'll see you guys in the morning. All right. We're back. We're going to unmold these dragons and stuff that we did. Oh, so let care. me get you down. All right. Here's the dragons I got. this one again. I like to hang him outside. Like a put him on my mailbox out there. <laughs> He's cute. He's really cute. There you go. There's the welcome dragon. He's cute. Uh, he don't really got big enough eyes to put any eyes in there. A little bit of an overpour there. I don't know how I did that one. But then, you know, I could be the overpour queen, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, I don't know the first thing about it. If if Miss April figured out about the collaboration, I might think about doing it. The only thing I got is some 
as far as Easter stuff. I think I have a bunny in that pack with the animals. I think there's a bunny in there. All right. Overflow taken care of. Very cute. Love it. Who's that one? I'm going to put this back in the bag and put it over there because I want to make it again. Then we have the Mama Dragon. That is, now this one was over poured. So it's going to, it might have some over pour on it. I thought I cleaned most of it up though. Yeah, let's get some of these points there. Go, bunny. Yeah, that was the one that, that we had a hard time getting it out of there, remember? Yeah. It's ears. Yeah. Yeah, it's ears were hard to get out. Oh, we're, we're picked off of here. Wow. Pretty cool. It's a mama with the baby dragon. At least that's what I think it is. Sure looks like a mama carrying the baby dragon. I like it. I like those colors. I really like them. Okay, so we'll put that one over there and take a picture of. Yeah, I'll have to pour this one again too. Because I know Miss Jean ain't going to take it home. <laughs> So I'll have to pour it again. Put it over there in my pour again pile. Okay. So this is the, I don't know, some kind of skull with double dragon heads. Got the tongue there. Come on, get out of there. Yeah, I've got overpour there too. Yep, I do. That's why it seems to be stuck there. Come on. Get out of there. Yeah, it's got overpour on little bits of overpour on that. Not a lot, just a little bit. Dang. Tiny That's loud. They're, they're, they're pitching those, mm -hmm. that tree in that truck. All right, here we go. I like this one too. It's cool. At least I think it is. I like oh, those. Yes. I like those colors. Yeah, those uh, kaleidoscope colors from Solar Color Dust. They're very pretty. I let his eyes fill in. I probably should have let his nose fill in with some black. Maybe next time. Turned out very cool. Okay, that'll get a picture of. Let's see, we got the Peace Guy, the Alien Peace Guy. It's poured in two different colors there. <laughs> yeah, he's kind of got some old pour going there, too. There it is. I got it. His fingers are a little soft. Are they? Yeah. Because I just did the fingers. The rest of it was already pretty hard. Mm. 
Yeah, he's a little go-to guy. I need to make him in green, but <laughs> with some black eyes. Yeah, it's a little go-to under the tray there. This is a dragon head. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I don't think it was supposed to fill in there, though. Mm -hmm. So those pieces are going to have to be gotten out of there, and it's got some overpour right there, too. So I got to get the overpour off and get those and two pieces yeah. cut out. And those are best cut out with, yeah, if they're not real thick, you can cut them out with the exacto knife if they're thin pieces. But if they're really thick, then I use my hot knife to cut them out because it's just easier, cuts quicker. And I also have to wear those oven gloves to keep from burning myself because I have burnt myself with it before. So I wear gloves with it so I don't burn myself. Just trying to carve it out. But I'm telling you, they are just heaving those Pitching right in. It. Pitching them right in. The, the neighbor was having a tree cut down, so they're just pitching them right into the back of that truck. Sounds like thunder. But it isn't. It's just them pitching that tree. I wonder, I wonder, I'm wondering if I shouldn't go get the name of the tree, guys. Why? Because I got one I'd like to get cut up and get out of my yard. Backyard. And, yep, and I also would like to um, get that limb taken out of that walnut tree before we have another big storm and it comes down on my fence. Yeah. So, I mean, I don't think that'd be very much, depending. I don't know. Some places are pretty expensive when it comes to trees. Yeah. If it was out of my yard, I would be happy. Mm -hmm. I've been trying to give the sucker away for firewood. Couldn't get no one to come get it. <coughs> All right. Yeah. There we go. Now it's cut out. It over pours out. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool looking. And here's okay, the and then oh, these are the ones that are not easy to get out. do not want to get cut by this. I already got one cut that I'm finally healing. Pray that alcohol down in there where I got it open. There's the little bear. Oh, 
not that I need it anymore because I had all kinds of these. Okay. That's pretty much, I mean, you can't I did, I did a bulldog, but it's not full, so it'll have to wait. Plus, I have baby little Groot over here, and Jeannie needs another little unicorn. So, that's it for this video. I'll do my shout out. Wanda's Bless Creations, Stacy underscore the Crafty Cat, Rez C. Liz, India Brady Art, Art by Me, Andrew Walker, Billy Holman Creations, Artsy Doodles, My Love of Crafts, Butch's Resin Corner, Dragons and Dresses Craftsatorium, Created with Wingless Angel, TLC's Handmade Hayloft, Roseanne's Crafting Corner, Cormarine's Resin Art, Marvelous Artsy, Crafting with Carla, Cynthia's Crafts and More, Amy's Resin Corner, Cat Johnson, The Blue Elephant Gifts, Custom Created Handmade Crafts, Resin Me Up, Clear Creations, and I think, I think that's all of them. That's all I got. So... We will see you on the next video. Um, I, Like I said, I am going to do this Saturday's live. But after this Saturday, they're going to go to uh, Friday nights at 6. So, i see you on Saturday. I don't know what I'm doing yet, but we'll see. Bye for now.